Well, as you can see, we're in uh, Costa de Guise. We've just had a pre-dinner drink in Brisa, which is part of the Melia Salinas Hotel. And it's kind of cocktail bar, chill out place. They do tapas. And you can walk straight out onto the beach from there. Lovely view of it as well. And you can see all the windsurfers. That quite cool uh, outrigger kayak we've been watching there. Been another glorious day here in Lanzarote. It's uh, now coming up to seven o'clock in the evening. And uh, probably still in the late 20s. And there's Las Cucharas Beach. We're going to walk around the corner to uh, Pueblo Marinero to see if we can find somewhere to get some dinner and to shoot some video for you. Still loads of people down on the beach. High tide at the moment, so quite a nice little wave to play on. Lots of wind surfboards out here. And a perfectly blue sky. We've come up now to Pueblo Marinero and uh, the Canary Internacional restaurant is uh, pretty busy. Let's go see what's going on in the square. The smell of food around here is fantastic. So we've had a cracking meal in uh, El Rincón, which is uh, one of our favourite tapas places in Costa Guise. And we're just walking through the square now. This is quite a big and busy place now. And on the left, we've got the Four Seasons Rock Cafe. Oh, in fact, it's on both sides now. It smells of steak, and there's a American diner up there. So let's walk you back through Pueblo Marinero now. A little bit later on, uh, coming up to half eight. Just have a look and see what, what it's like through here. to let those people go through and it's quite busy here now That's particularly busy up there. Mm. Ah, Hook Cocktail Bar is open again. Okay, well, we'll uh, just walk through all the way to the other side of the square here. Aljibe's tap room there is not open at the moment. I love this section of Pueblo Marinero. Bit early for Havana says coming up to 8.30. Spanish clientele don't tend to come and eat until 9, 10 o'clock at night. There's the Black Bull and these uh, bars down here, the boatyard, are all very busy at the moment, as you can imagine.
tough spas now, haven't we? Yeah, we've got Maison Tampella. Cortina Cojo. Cortina Cojo, cooked pig. Uh -huh. I don't really want to video the kids' playground yeah. for obvious reasons. They sound like they're having fun though. There's a great French uh, pastelleria, panaderia, coming up on the right. And La Familia. We used to have meetings there quite often with is our accountant we used to meet there, Jules. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Ah, yes, that was his other favourite place. Okay, so uh, sun's setting now. We'll probably go and find somewhere for a sundowner now, but that uh, is Costa de Guise in its new, extremely busy state in the evenings. Back to normal, really. <laughs> 